Thanks for joining us today. In this video, we're going to be reacting to our second comedy clip from Louis C.K. Okay, so our first introduction was, of course, but maybe. Now, I've just gone and I've seen this one, getting fat. Interesting. Let's go find out what this means. All right, without any further ado, people, let's go. <laughs> I don't really have a shot with him, I think, because <laughs> I just don't rate movie stars. I'm not really fucking fat. It's ridiculous. Like, I even wear, like, I have this problem now. My pants keep, like, I can't keep them, as, they won't stay up. Because here's what happens. Okay, you get fat, and some of you skinny people won't, I don't give a shit about you. You won't get this. I, I hate skinny people because they don't empathize with fat guy problems. They just don't, like, you ever have a skinny friend, you're trying to tell them, like, I just, I just wish I could have one donut and fucking walk away. I wish I could do that. I wish I had the power to eat a donut. And, and your skinny friend's like, well, just eat the donut then. What's this big deal? You should totally just have a donut if you want. You should totally go ahead and have one. Let's just enjoy yourself and have a donut if you like that. <laughs> Fuck you. You don't get it. It's a whole spiral that begins with a donut. Later, I'm killing hookers. I don't even remember what happened. <laughs> They're trying to be. They're trying to. Uh, they're trying to not be judgmental. I want to believe. It's a whole spiral that begins with a donut. Later, I'm killing hookers. I don't even remember what happened. <laughs> but so here's what happens: you get fat, and your pants start to get tight, right? And then. You get fatter because it's not like, oh, I'll stop eating now, you know? <laughs> and then suddenly all your pants fucking hurt. Like every pair of pants hurts. And then you eat even more because it's like, fuck it now, man. Who even cares? <laughs> Fat shit. I'm fucking obsessed with food. I went to this fucking uh, uh, thing with my wife and kids where it was like the kids and their kid friends and just a house full of assholes, you know, that have kids. <laughs> And I'm just sitting there fucking, I just want to kill myself and I just want a bomb to drop on the whole house and take us all out. And I get in there, but then there's a plate of cookies. And like, as soon as I'm like, that's what I'm done. I'm eating every fucking cookie on that plate. That's what I'm here. That's what this all is, is fucking that. So, so it's your way of trying to deal. <laughs> it's trying to kind of like console yourself and deal with... <laughs> Pay yourself. That's the word. You're trying to pay yourself, compensate yourself for having to deal with the drop on the whole house and take us all out. And I get in there, but then there's a plate of cookies. And like, as soon as I'm like, that's what I'm done. I'm eating every fucking cookie on that plate. That's what I'm here. That's what this all is. It's fucking that. So, and I, you have to have a strategy, you know, you can't just fucking, uh, you can't just fucking stand there and just fucking, yeah, I, you, have to you gotta, you have to like sort of keep rediscovering the cookies, you know, you have to walk over and go like, oh, hey, yeah. Yeah. Oh, who brought those? That's cool. That's interesting. Yeah. You do this, this means like, I, I totally could not eat it, but oh, fuck, I'll just, don't want to hurt people's feelings, brought the cookie, you know, like, oh, that's interesting, yeah, I can take it and leave it. Yeah, totally fucking radar back there. Okay, new people around the dish, do it again. Hey, fucking... <laughs> if people start noticing, you have to say something like, these are crazy, like, I'm a dick. I don't know what it is about them. Yeah, it's the fucking cookies. It's not you're a piece of shit that can't stop eating anything. But, um... <laughs> So here's what happens. So you get fat enough, though, what happens is your belly starts to push out like this, and then it pushes your pants down to your pelvis because they won't hang in the normal place anymore. And then down there, the, you're, they feel loose, and you start going, hey, losing weight, all right, I'm coming down. My pants are getting loose. I am getting thinner. I ate my way through to the other side. I did. I don't, I don't. That's an interesting excuse, isn't there? Pants are falling down, so it means you're losing weight. That's an interesting one. Never heard that bit before. I ate my way through to the other side. I did. <laughs> oh, 
fucking, I don't, I don't give a shit. I'm fat. Look at this shit. I don't fucking care. Look at that. I don't care. It's just a sweaty bowl of fucking flesh. I don't care. Look how fucked up this is, too. It goes right in. Like, it goes at a right angle. It hits my pelvis. It doesn't, like, slope back down. It fucking goes in and then back up. It's fucked up. Like, when I'm in the shower and I'm scrubbing like this, when I get down there, I got to turn in like this. I got to actually make a turn. <laughs> fucking cut in. Or the crevice gets fucking filthy. It's ridiculous. It is. It's like a theater seat. There's like fucking receipts and shit and popcorn and fucking kids' toys and oh fuck, what the hell? What <laughs> does? Okay, interesting. <laughs> oh, all right. Um, <laughs> you know what? <clears throat> You can't make a fat joke without taking the mick out of yourself to start with. And this is the beauty of it, isn't it? Because you you disheart, disarm people when you're, when you're able to kind of take the mick out of yourself. Because sometimes people can take themselves a little bit too seriously. But in comedy, you can't do that. And this looks like a, an old joke, but people kind of go mental these days when you start making jokes like this isn't it and you're like it's a joke <laughs> this guy is funny um i've just seen another one it says um lewis learns about the catholic church mm -hmm. let's go find out what this is shall we all right if you like what we're all about please like subscribe and join our community and until next time people it has been kings peace Bye for now.